Uh, I'm Fergus Hughes and I'm a first year HSBS student. Um, my name is Miriam and I study graduate medicine. So my name is Vrinda Shanoi and I'm reading for an MPhil in pathology. Hello, my name is Cecilia. Um, I am a Anthropocene Studies student. Um, I'm a postgrad student in the Geography Department. So I'm the recipient of the Ken Griffin Clinical Medicine Scholarship and um, it's enabled me to sort of do all my studies and get involved in extracurriculars without having to worry about um, having to work during term time or in the holidays at all because we don't really get very many holidays in graduate medicine. Okay, yeah, so I'm really lucky to be on the sports, sports bursary here um, which really helps me with my rugby um, and it sort of not only takes financial pressure off me but allows me to sort of invest money into my sporting um, activities as well, so whether that's food, equipment, anything like that. Um, and with my, with my head injury as well, there's a few extra sort of things I have to pay for. Um, and the, the sports bursary has really allowed me to sort of just not worry about that and be able to sort of go full into my academics as well as full into my rugby here, which is something, you know, I really want to keep doing. I mean, it's benefited me in so many different ways, right? Um, I think coming from, um, yeah, coming from the background that I do, I wouldn't have been able to be here if it wasn't for a scholarship, right? Um, but beyond that, it's really given me the opportunity to invest in something that I'm really interested in, right? In my undergrad experience, I um, began connecting really deeply um, with kind of my passion for the environment and learning about, um, you know, just the ways that humanity can interact with the environment in a, in a healthy way. Um, and I, became really, really interested in that topic and I really wanted to be in spaces where people were also thinking about those things and having those conversations. Um, and, you know, I think my senior year of undergrad was like exactly what I wanted, um, but I wanted more still because one year is, is, is not a lot. <laughs> um, and so um, I think being able to be at Cambridge, being able to be at this space, and being able to speak to people who kind of uh, share this passion and share this love for the environment. Um, and like together we can kind of build on new ideas um, and transform our own ideas as well. And that has been really, really unique and special. So um, uh, I was very lucky to be awarded the Ebenezer Ademsoe Award this year. Um, and I think um, I resonate a lot with what uh, Mr. Ebenezer thinks about, uh, thought about when he started this award actually. Um, I believe that it takes um, educating one person uh, in a community to lift up the entire community in most cases. So, um, and uh, the second thing is how minority representation is still very low in uh, institutes of higher education. So that's something I'm passionate about. And in that way, I kind of resonate a lot with this award. So I'm lucky. <laughs> So um, if it weren't for the scholarship, I don't think I would have been here in the first place. So um, it uh, helped me a lot with uh, both personal as well as financial problems that I had. It was uh, the tuition funds that were a little a bit of a problem. And then uh, also, um, get, um, I'm not that close to my family. So breaking up away from them and uh, coming here, the journey could only be possible because of this award. So.